what's going on guys so i just wanted to let you guys know exactly what's been going on uh with my life for the past i guess like two weeks i haven't really been on youtube or whatever but uh i'm back and better than ever and uh first off if you haven't subscribed just subscribe it's uh i got some videos coming up uh they're gonna be awesome yeah, I took a pause because I was just was like playing them in my head and just thinking about how awesome they are. So they're going to be amazing. So um, also, I just wanted to kind of keep you guys posted. I, uh, I weighed in uh, a little while ago. I don't know if you, if you follow me on Instagram, you probably already know. I got down to 255.7 pounds. So uh, that's down from 272. So that's like 72, uh, 72 pounds. That would have been sick. Uh, that's about uh, 17 pounds. So uh, I'm really enjoying this uh, this process of uh, losing the weight, and I guess the purpose of this video is to really just show you guys that I'm not doing this diet just to uh, to lose weight. You know, like I mean, like that's like a, an awesome byproduct to it. But the real thing was to prove to myself that I care and I love myself. I uh, I've been through a lot of depression, and I'm not going to go into it here. But I I do have in my blog. Uh, I'll post the link in the description below, but uh, I do have a lot of depression and things like that, and I got to a point in my life where I just did not care. I didn't care. I wouldn't shower, wouldn't get out of bed, wouldn't eat. There was a point in my life when I lost 30 pounds in one month because I wouldn't eat because I wouldn't get out of bed. So I've had some really, really tough times, and doing this diet has just been the epitome of self-care to me. I've never cared about myself this much. I've never tried uh, that hard to get myself to, f to feel okay, to, uh, to be okay, and I've never put this much effort in. I think uh, I had like, uh, I like to call it like the magic pill syndrome where I thought eventually something would happen, it'd be like a magic pill, and I would just, uh, you know, I would just be better. You know, and I, I think everyone wants that. You know, like who doesn't want to wake up one day and be like, oh, it cured. Yeah, this is great. So I decided to put in some work. I put in a lot of work. I went through uh, something called TMS. It really uh, it really helped my brain uh, with uh, a lot of the negative thinking that I've been doing and uh, a lot of the negative thinking habits that I got into. I've been doing a lot of uh, therapy. I've been really doing that. And those things gave me a little bit of relief. And that was just the amount of relief I needed in order to start this diet. And then since I've started this diet, the results have been out of this world crazy, like mentally. You know, I've, uh, you know, I, I just, I look forward to tomorrow now. I'm curious about my results with the diet. I'm curious about what tomorrow brings rather than being like, you know, devastated that I'm here again tomorrow. You know, that's kind of the point that I was in for a long time. So I, uh, yeah, I, just wanted to like let you guys know that I'm, I'm down to 255. My goal weight is around 235. Uh, I've been going to the gym every day. That's been another point of pain, a pain point for me, I guess, would be the gym. I, I really had no self-confidence. So I would go to the, I, I wasn't able to go to the gym. I, I remember literally being so upset in my room one day, this is about a year ago, two years ago, because I knew the best thing to do for me was exercise. And I wasn't able to, I, I just couldn't get out of my room. I couldn't go to the gym because I was so afraid of what people would think. If people would say, oh, he, he's a big guy, but he can't lift weights. He's a, he's a, he, he can't do cardio. He can't run on the treadmill. He can't do this. He can't do that. But meanwhile, you know, like in reality, that was just like my brain tricking me into thinking that I wasn't good enough. So, for some reason, I wasn't uh, the the amazing athlete that I feel like I should be. So the beautiful thing uh, now is that I, I had a, a, a good friend of mine, uh, Nate, a shout out to Nate. He helped me get into the gym. He helped me create a routine and get in there day after day and uh, really after going, after fighting through that pain threshold that is the that little bit that you really need to will yourself to get to the gym. And then once you get to the gym, you realize it's really not that bad. Nobody really cares what I'm doing at the gym. And if they do, you know, who cares? I don't, I don't, you know, I, I try not to think about what they think of me or anything like that. But uh, it became a lot less of a scary place. And then now that I'm able to go to the gym with the keto diet, I've, uh, 
I'm really excited about these results. I, uh, I'm not sure if I already said it. I kind of like ramble a little bit, but uh, subscribe to my videos. And uh, yeah, so I can't wait. I, I got another video planned. It's uh, going to be me and my girlfriend talking about like uh, what it's like to diet as a couple. And uh, I can't wait uh, to, to see you guys uh, next time. I can't wait. All right.